do that, my husband had to leave. Um, he probably is going to his moonlighting job since gas prices have gone up so much. But that really is what he's doing. But he, before he left, he said, please tell these people I'm an idiot. I said, you give me that permission? <laughs> he said, when you recognize some people, it, it never fails to overlook someone else. And he felt horrible that he had overlooked quite a few miracles in this room. And Paul Briggs and your wife are two of them. We have all been touched by cancer in some way or another, our family, our close friends. And with that in mind, how close it is to all of us and to all our hearts, I'm especially pleased and proud that my daughter Heidi has made a decision to walk in the Washington, D.C. Susan G. Komen three-day walk for a cure. That is 60 miles in three days. They do about 20 miles each day. And, they, and when she was asked, when she was registering, uh, do you have this in your family? And, and fortunately we do not, but that, not, that is not always the case. It isn't necessarily familial. But she said, because we've been blessed, and so far we really haven't had it in our family yet, but it is just a cause that she wishes to take part in. And in addition to your applause, you can have the opportunity to help her in another way. Each participant in the walk must raise $2,300 for the Susan G. Komen Foundation. And Heidi has used all of her best skills that she got in college, all those things we paid for, her marketing and <coughs> communications. And she has Carabas donating a wonderful meal on March the 30th at 6 o'clock at our church's new fellowship center. They're donating, I believe it's chicken marsala and pasta pomodoro. We have Pepsi donating the beverages, J&S donating cobblers for dessert. And we are just really thrilled by this. And she is going to, she wants it to be affordable, especially in these times. Uh, I know that that wonderful meal of chicken marsala normally costs about 18 bucks when I've gotten it. But you can get it for $6. The, on the 30th. Or if you have a family of four, you get an even better bargain. It's four for 20. So that's five dollars a piece. Um, I have a poster up here and a sign-up sheet. We do need to have a number. We're expecting between 100 and 150 people uh, that evening. It's a Wednesday evening at six o'clock. There will be takeout boxes as well. So if you need to take it and then scoot on to any church activities that Wednesday evening, uh, we would just love to have you participate in this. It's a great bargain. Carabas will be out there cooking the meal on the premises. Uh, we're just really thrilled about that. They're not just sending it out in pans. They're going to come out and cook it. So it'll be a big event for us. Uh, Calvary is very proud of their new fellowship center being completed, and it's a great gathering place. We want it to be a light in the community, not just for our church. That's one of the goals of our, that committee when they were planning that building, was to, for it to be a light in the community. And so this is an opportunity for you to come and have a great meal. There will also be some donate to win items. Uh, Bernice Troutman has donated a print of one of her wonderful paintings. There will be a basket of wonderful items as well. So we hope you'll come out and enjoy us that evening. If all you can do is just come and get a to-go box, that'd be great too. But for $6 a piece or $20 for a family of, of four, I think you'll have a fun evening and everything will be decorated in pink, but men can still come anyways. <laughs> so please come up here and sign up or see myself uh, before the end of the day, and we would just love to have you participate and join us. Thank you. Thank you, Rob.